Billy Wiz Gamer back online and we're playing Candle the Power of the Flame. This is part one. I just downloaded the game. I thought I'd give it a go. It looks quite fun. Tells us that the gods created and destroyed the world four times. <gasps> Bastards, why would they do that? Why not just create it once and do it perfect? Down from the sky and struck the earth. From it flowed water, spilling out over the mountains and plains. With it, life was born. After their intervention, the gods observed how this life expanded. Patiently, they watched its evolution and development. Trees spread over the arid earth and the sky previously grey and roiled by endless storms, turned calm. Time passed, and the ephemeral creatures that inhabited the world evolved. Intelligence and consciousness emerged. Some of the beings started to speak to their creators. They thanked them for having given their lives meaning, for things worth striving, and for dreams. With all this, something marvelous came into being, civilization. The different peoples multiplied and flourished in harmony, sharing knowledge and becoming wiser and wiser. The gods contemplated all of this with satisfaction. But then, something happened. <gasps> uh oh. These creatures who had come so far were invaded by ambition and greed. All the knowledge accumulated over centuries, all the advances were now being used by some to dominate others. That's when the violence started. Wars broke out like a great storm, devastating everything in its path. Everything that these beings had achieved evaporated. The gods were furious. A great firestorm raised the earth and burned down its forests. The water that emanated from the mountains evaporated. The peoples were condemned and all intelligent creatures vanished in the flames. Then the gods decided to try again. Mm hmm. Well, quite unsuccessful the first time, weren't they, the gods? If they're supposed to be all knowing and everything. The teachings of his master flooded his mind. Teku opened his eyes. In front of him, he saw all the stars in the firmament. Suddenly, he heard a fire crackling nearby. The last thing he remembered were the voices of alarm. His home was being attacked. Then, he staggered to his feet. There was no time to lose. That's me. Move to your left. Run. Do we do we do? Can I go this way? Yeah. Press A to jump vertically and grab and grab and grab. Press A while jumping and move forward. Huh? Press A to jump vertically. Oh, okay. I'm pressing. If you walk closer to the fire and I can will show, press X to interact. You can take all the actions that were pressing. Nothing now. Go back down. Press down on the D-pad, okay. Jump to the other side! Hey, they call me Long Jump Bill. Grab that, mate. You can check the inventory by pressing pause in the pause or by pressing Y. 
broken torch. This torch broke from a past in one of the villagers cabins or potion, but can still be used to carry fire with it. Okay. Teko couldn't go on. It was too dark. <clears throat> oh, Teko. Right, don't worry, Teko, we've got it all under control. We're gonna jump over there, light up the torch, get the torch, and then we can do the cabin. Don't worry about it, got it all under control. How can I how can I use that? I wanna use a broken torch. Yeah. Yeah. Why would I pick it up? Pick it up. Oh, okay. He can light his hands. He can just beep. Always burning. You will come across these little torches in the adventure. You can light them up to create fire so you can turn your candle on again. Okay. Is it? Nice one, mate. Is that there? Oh, no, that's lit. Who's whinging? Oh, him. Don't look up. Yeah. Oh, no. That poor man told Teku what happened. The tribe of the Wakcha had attacked the village and captured prisoners. No. One of them was Yaka, the tribe's shaman. He sounds disgusting. Yaka. We would do something. Oh, no. That's it, I'll go Gamungu Sugar Pat, mate. I'm gonna go Gamungu Sugar Pat. I understand exactly what he meant. Oh, he's not a goodie. He's got a hook for a hand. Kill him, let's get him. Sure. Oh no, a Wakcha warrior. When there's an enemy nearby, a tech who will walk stealthily to not make any noise. Do not jump or run near an enemy. Get out of the cabin quietly. Right, we're gonna stealthily murder this little munchkin. Sneaky, sneaky. Some enemies will detect your candle if you are near. Turn off the candle by holding down B. That's it, my candle's off. Move him closer to the watcher and push him into the chasm. Sneaky, sneaky. Ah, you didn't even see me coming, did ya? Turn on the candle. I know you can use the saber power of the fire to... Cast a big flash around him with it, you will uncover secrets. Activate mechanis mechanisms and this makes some characters react. Press B to use the light bulb. I need to light myself up first, I think. How is this? I can't see it. Oh, okay, I'm supposed to run over there and do it. <clears throat> Don't worry, guys. Got it all under control. Run! Alright. Use your power, like. There's an escape pod. Don't worry. All under control, guys. Smoothly done. Let's go, mate. We're on our way to the next level. Yes. Do you want to save? Yes. Uh, you know, completely smashed that level, mate. Do you wish to overwrite slot? Yeah, why not? That's saved, isn't it? All saved. Before going into the forest, Teku looked back one last time. Poor Teku. His village, once full of life, was now an immense flame that reared up against the darkness of the night oh. sky. We all love, we all hate flames at the rear. The few survivors left waved goodbye to Teku in a small gesture of hope. You can do it, Teku. The tears streamed down their masks as they thought about all that had been lost. But there was no time to lose. And there's a lot to gain. We can do this. Less positive thinking. To find Yaka and the rest of his men. Yeah. We go get Yaka. After all, a light guide must never abandon its shaman. Yeah. 
After three hours of crossing the forest, as he followed the trail of the Wakjas, the first rays of sun started to filter through the branches of the trees. When he emerged from the thicket, Teku stopped at the foot of a cliff. The captor's trail ended there. There was a large marsh down below, and a few bonfires dotted the landscape. It could be them. Only one way to find out. Teku leaned out over the abyss, trying to figure out the best way of getting down. Without realizing that the ground he was walking on was giving way under his feet. His adventure was about to begin. Hey, first the youth passes and quickest way to get down. Well done. Oh, wake up, drown. Teku. Come on. Wake up, Teku. Don't die on me. It's so early on in the game. We need you to get some air. Alright, good work, Teku. Right. Oh, look at all the spiders on the ground. Let's see if I can get up here. No, not at the moment, anyway. Maybe I, maybe I can get up here. Why can't I carry it? Touch any of the ledges? Right, I'll come back to that. I can't lie because I've got no flame. Oh my god, I got eaten! I've been eaten! Oh Jesus. Tell you what, that frog looked quite friendly for a minute, didn't it? I can understand I can push this. I can't push it any further than that. I've only got to jump on that and then jump up onto something, but I just don't know where. I can't push it any further. Look, these branches should be grabbable in my opinion. Right, none of the buttons do anything else. Let's push that over here. Ah, knew it. I don't know what button I'm supposed to be pressing. I'm pressing them all. Eventually, one will give way to me. Ah, uh, got the golden jug of milk. Just what I was after. What's that all about? Empty jar, a very old ceramic jar, nicely decorated. It was partially broken, but it could still be used to carry some food. It had a golden colour, just like the honey. Okay. Right, clearly I'm not supposed to go any further that way. Can I use the honey? Or maybe I can collect some of that nectar. How do I... Controls run, blah, blah, blah. Climb services. Oh, fall off a ledge down. Right, let's turn off panel. Hmm. Short jump. Oh, okay. Save so game, use candles, if I buy some tool. 
I thought I was supposed to get that honey from up there. What am I supposed to do with this guy? He's just gonna kill me, isn't he? Ah, too fast for him. What's this do? Oh, I can save? Okay, why not? Why the hell not? Turn that on. Ah. Secret ladder. Where is this going to take me to? Where am I going? Let's find out. Oh, there's another bit. All right. Cool man, I'm climbing right up now. Teku observed the gigantic carved rock. It appeared to be an effigy of a powerful toad. It must represent somebody important. Nevertheless, the wooden structure didn't seem very stable. Am I alive? Am I dead? I'm dead! Right, don't worry guys, I've got it all under control. RUN! Oh my Jesus, my Christ. Don't worry guys, I got it all under control. All under control. Never die. Never do anything wrong. Jump! Jump! Right, run! He's coming! Run this way, I reckon hide here. Can we duck? Well, that clearly isn't the way to do it, is it? Duck. Alright, let's go, I'm just gonna climb down there. Come on, you big ugly toad. Why aren't you small? What the hell? Well, that didn't work out well. Where's my ladder gone? Where's my ladder gone? I don't get it. I don't really, I still don't really know. Right, my ladder's there, which is fine. As long as I can jump up that ladder in a second, but it seems to go somewhere. Don't go anywhere, ladder. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Where am I supposed to go? Why does that do that if I do it like that? Alright, god damn it. Right. 
Maybe that's what I've got to do. I don't know if this is... Yes! That's how you do it. Good work, Teku. Oh, now you bring your ladder up. Now you make it a bit easier to dodge it, don't you? What's this gold thing up here? Give it to me. I want gold. Where is it? A large symbol painted in green was hidden behind the enormous rock. He didn't know its meaning, but he had the feeling it was something important. Good work, Teko. You're very investigative. Very helpful man. Might go over the old froggy frog there. It was carved and ready to slice like an eye. It was not very useful as a weapon, but this frog was the perfect tool for any novice adventure. Teku wouldn't get rid of it during the journey, as he may need to use it many times. Well. Where's Teku got to use it? We can get out there, mate. Yes. A what have we seen up there? Mechanism seemed to be controlling the water coming out of the enormous gourd. And Teku remembered having seen that symbol before. It's beautiful, this game. I love all these graphics like this. Really nice. Nice on the eye. Right, these. What is this one gonna do? Oh, okay. Who am I using that? No? I wanted to look a little bit left. I wanted to see if there was anything there. Oh, that's my drink. Jesus Christ, man. I was just trying to get back over. Give me it. Look, Dude, you have to jump on this. To... And that hides that. I that. just. This geezer, I tell you what, in real life. It'd just be dead, wouldn't it? Because if you die every time, you have a little bit of a like problem, or a spike tries to get you in the noggin. Well then, you're as good as dead, aren't you? Right, I think I know this now. So this one, like that. I don't understand. I need to get to that third one now, though. I think. Damn it! I was trying to get to that little grassy bit that was over there. Right, back to here. I'm sure this is really entertaining for you guys to watch because this is, you know, ha ha ha, this guy's rubbish. But really, if you tried it, it'd be just as difficult for you. Right, come on, come on, matey, Teku. We've got to get these scoundrels that pillaged and raped all your family. Right, so that, that up there. That up there. Oh, that's cool. A strange mechanism yeah, we saw that. controlling the water coming right. out of the enormous gourd. And Teku remembered having seen that symbol before. I do. 
Oh, I can get up there. Okay, cool. That's the way I've got to go. Don't worry, I've got it all under control. I think we've got to try and get all them symbols up the right way. So that's up the right way now, yeah? So that's cool. That's it, Teko. I didn't realise we could go over this way. It makes a lot of sense now. Can we climb up here anywhere? Come, Tex. Let's do it, mate. Yeah, oh, no, that's not done. What the bloody hell? What the bloody hell, mate? What the bloody hell? <laughs> well, that's not how you do it, is it? Why did I do that again? That was stupid. Stupid manoeuvre. Oh, I don't know. Maybe I can cut this stuff. Cut it. Yeah, use that. Cut. Where else can I go? Surely I'm supposed to. I was almost on it there. I can see that there's a big bit in the ground. I want to go down there. Why can't I go down there? I want to use my car rock. I don't want to initiate that again, do I? Where am I supposed to go? facing the right, the symbol's in the middle, but that final one isn't. See, that's upside down. So it's a symbol of the man with like the two eyes and the three faces. So they're both right now, yeah? That's not going to turn out, it just turns that one. Right. be something to do with these little things up here. Flames don't seem to do anything. Why? Wow. I don't understand why that's all got to be. Oh, at least we got more. Hey, don't know, boys and girls, finally. Jesus Christ.
Okay. That's the plan, mate. We can try to do it like that. Yes, I'm up. Got it. Go down the ladder. Finally, man. Took me long enough. I can't light it because my flame's not lit. When can I light my flame? Where is that? Hey, I can save it now. Would you like to write? Right. Yes. Right. It was a Wakja warrior. But unfortunately, there was no trace of the shaman. It's possible that the main group had gone on ahead. He had to be careful. They were very dangerous. Hey, look it. One's asleep and the other one's looking into a wall longingly. Right, come on. Oh, don't go too high, mate. No! Damn nabbit! Right, don't worry. <clears throat> ah, he saw the fire and ran. Right, let's light this can. Ah, opens up a secret area. Back to there. Okay. Nice one. Nice one, mate. Let's go down there. Oh, you put my flame out. Boy, I wanted my flame. I thought there was something else to light backwards. And then I'll go fight them people in a minute. Go fight them bad baddies. Oh, got the flame. Right, let's go down. Go down, down, down. Got through without them attacking my flame. Grab something now, I'm not even sure what that was. Nothing to light up this way, was it? Right, that's cool though. We've got a little shortcut now. We'll go through there. Come oh. Damn it. I wanted to use one of them super ones. Go on, up you go. Let's go right this way. Fight them people. I'm not sure how I'm going to kill them yet. Oh no, he got me. It's not funny, me. It's not funny. Got distracted. Oh, okay. I'm thinking I need to. Well, oh, I think I worked it out. I think I need to go down here. I need to get the light. <clears throat> I need to go back 
I need to get a bolt. And I've got nothing to put into that big weapon. Which is not good. It's not helping me out in any way, shape or form. Come on, mate. Come Deku, get up there, mate. We've got to light up. Let's go. Let's do this, mate. We've been hanging around for too long. Don't worry, guys. I've just been running around like a headless chicken, but I can do some editing to get rid of that. Because I'm a master editor these days. I'm not really. I can just about delete things. Wait, I've got down here. This is what I think. I'm not 100% sure. Right down here. Yeah, run from the flame, you pussy. And go over here. Go up there, Teko. Is it, mate? Like that. Is that not going to give me anything good? I need to find a bolt or something. This way, it's the other way. I think. Right. What happened there? Gotta grab something. He had heard stories about those platforms. The ancients used them to travel rapidly to distant places. But to use it, he needed his candle to be burning. My candle is burning. Where am I trying, where am I going? Where have I gone? This is just confusing. I feel as I'm not ready for this level yet. Let's go back. That big purple toad looks extremely scary. Hey. Mm. So that's one way. There we go. That's what I needed. Perfect. I knew there was something in this little bit I missed. God damn it. The little munchkins trying to hide the information from me. It's not going to work this time. I'm coming back with my dart and I'm going to murk them little munchkins up. Alright, kill on, mate. We'll go through the sewers. We know the back routes or the underwater caves. Don't worry about your torch. Don't need that now. In fact, it's better if it's off. Alright, right, right. Straight over this. Jump like a pro. Right, what's this geezer doing? Is he? He's coming back. Yeah, you can have another wonder mate, but don't you worry. I got all your days are numbered. You see me under here? Yeah, you won't for long. You won't for long. Come, move on. Don't look at that square. We got. A plan to come together. Perfect. Well, my friends, that certainly did not work out as well as I anticipated. <laughs> oh well, don't worry. I shot myself in the back of the head with a dart, but this time I'm more I understand the mechanics and the physics of the game. I got it all under control again. All under control. Oh, 
Right, now. I just wait here. Well, I'm supposed to get both of them with one dot. It's going to be a bit tricky. Alright, well, let's try it without letting them know. Come on, mate. This game's like little by little, isn't it? I worked out that I needed a dart, I got a dart, it took me ages. Now I need not realise I've got to put the dart in here, but that's not going quite as quickly as I was hoping. Oh no, they both see me again. Run, Teku! <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. The problem is I ran in the first place. If I didn't run in the first place, you wouldn't have heard me, but I just got too excited. I just wanted to run away. And... Right, come on, Teku, we can do it this time. Come on, Teku. Come on. Come on. Get that geese to move out of the way. Goodbye, mate. As I was saying, your days are numbered. I've worked it all out. Great right, work, come take it. Sneak off, sneak off, sneak off. Don't let me see you. Go down there. Beautiful. Right. Now. Come on. Stand on that platform, mate. Well, he's not standing on the platform, is he? Why are you not standing on that platform? Okay, alright. But that was terrible, man. Why does this keep happening to me? Oh. He not be off. Come on, just get me, just get me. Just be quicker. Ah, ha, 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 ha. You can't see me. Sneaky, sneaky. Ah, oh, just kill me. Just kill me. Can't be bothered. Come on, right. Start again. Here we go. I'm gonna get. I'm finishing this level. I don't care. Even if it takes me seven hours and I delete. Six and a half hours of it. Don't care. I'll get this level done. second one all right maybe I'm not supposed to alert the first one until I get the dart back out the back of his head get it back in there for the second one to come up honestly Deku if you could just learn how to use a sword of some description it would be massively helpful and influential in the plan of this game rather than running around like a coward making sure they shoot themselves Again, we can do it, boys. We can do it this time. I'm gonna have to take one of them out a different way. And the only mess up. Right. That's it. That's it. Run, mate. Run. Got him! Yes! In your face! In your face! Can I take my dart back? No, it's gone so into his head I can't get it out again. 
Alright, where do we go from here? Can I go in the water? Right, there must have been a point of coming this way, I didn't just... What the hell? I don't know. Hey. <coughs> Bless. <coughs> Bless me. Oh, sees his knee. Right, got me. Got me flame on. Oh, god damn it! I'm supposed to just press it to. Damn that it. Let's go up here. Alright, let's... Nothing it appears. What was the point of us coming this way? I don't think there was any point. That's just the abyss. It was just to kill these guys. Okay, well. I think it'll be quite a good stage to uh, stop the video. I'll go back and I'll save it. And then from there, I'll just get on with the next level. I want to save it there. Done this now. Well done, mate. We killed a few of them. Let's go back. Thank you for watching, boys and girls. And please subscribe, like, comment, and let me know what you think of this game. I really like the graphics. And I like the puzzle solving, even if I am a bit slow at it. And a bit... Well, you know, hey, we tried. We tried and we succeeded in the end. Uh, save here. Yeah, thank you for watching and please subscribe for part two of this playthrough. Do you know it? Yeah, I do. Right, Billy was gamer over and it's up.